And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Porto, and they take on Maritimo. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. the starting 11 for Porto. Well, they're playing in a 4-4-2, with one of the strikers just dropping that little bit deeper. His role is to find space between the defensive lines, but he can only do that if his partner makes forward runs. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the full-back and winger, and, of course, the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And the contest begins. The cross is on. Rendell. It's looking promising. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. A fine reading of the situation. It's there for him! Brilliant save! Good refereeing, waiting for a natural break before administering the caution. And over it comes. Well, he took care of it defensively. An attack full of promise and fine goalkeeping. Who can they pick out? Wonderful header, excellent goalkeeping. Throwing pressure here, and another corner. Short corner taken. Otavio. Dangerous looking attack, and using his body to good effect. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Cutting the ball back, excellent block. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. It's opening up for them. And a chance to whip it in here. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping!
Now sending it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. And a fine tackle. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Ottavio. Oh, good vision. Well, what a stop that was. And as a play it goes, throw-in coming up here. And a throw-in it's going to be. Options in the centre. Well, possession seeded. Good movement. Might be able to set up the chance, but mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. They have possession again. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Crossing opportunity. Can they get themselves in front here? Oh, that is a superb save. Using his physical strength to shield it. Tagieu, Rafi Kitan. Now moving the ball impressively here and whipped into the box. Cuts it back. Magnificent defending. Luis Diaz. Mateo Suribe. Otavio. Bruno Costa. Otavio now. Opportunity. A goal! 1 0. A fully deserved advantage based on what we've seen. Well, here's the replay, and it shows how patient they were in the build-up. Just so assured, waiting for the right moment. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? on the scent of something positive but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending well very close to half time now and it's a narrow lead for the home side Stuart how would you assess what you've seen well it's been a tight game so far but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball particularly in midfield where they've just started to take control they'll be fairly happy going at half time if it stays like this Rendell They won't complain about having won the corner and maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. <laughs> Taken short. Oh, blocked it! Denied again. Keen to take it short here.
Shot attempted. Able to get a body in the way. That is that for the first half here. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Ottavio. Can't miss, surely! And able to close down the shot. A short corner, let's see. Cuts it back. And that is going to be a free kick. To extend their lead here. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. And over it comes. Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now! And the lead fully merited. Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So 2-0 now. <laughs> Edgar Costa. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Otavio. Costa hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them and intercepts again. The room to roam on the wing, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And the counter attack is on, options available. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Well, those stats confirm it. Porto have enjoyed the majority of the possession, and they've... He's got to score! And the keeper is showing tremendous command. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Well, they're going for the short one. Mehdi Karami. The outcome is a goal kick here.
the attack looks promising. And space to cross it. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, Derek, I have to say, he has been a joy to watch today. You just want the ball to go to him. Some of his passing has been brilliant. And, of course, he's created a goal. Magnificent performance. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Uribe into the final 20 minutes Costa now with Uribe Tony Martinez under pressure doesn't seem to be bothering him and a good looking pass opportunity to deliver the cross Rendell and a promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end now can they counter clinically the referee correctly decided to play advantage and the intention was to let the play flow but no real advantage forthcoming and now a free kick Bruno Costa what can they do from here? Takes it on! There it is! Victory more or less guaranteed now! Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Ivan Rossi. Costa. Zainadine. Well, visionary passing. Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. And time for the change now. Martinez, Mehdi Tarami. Wonderful tackle. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. This looks threatening. Oh, it was a close run thing, but the goalkeeper just got there first. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Luis Diaz, Martinez, good physical play. Now well, he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? Particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively and almost cutting through at will at times. The result never much in doubt, if I'm honest. 
But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?